What's up guys? This is Jess from the Active Workplace and today I'm taking you through a back and abs routine that's only 12 minutes long. You'll need at least one set of dumbbells for this workout. You'll be working for 45 seconds and resting for 10, completing each circuit twice before moving on to the next. When you hear the ding, it's time to go. When you hear the horn, it's time to rest. You're always going to get this heads up for what's up ahead, and we are starting with plank to rows in four, three, two, one. So you want to have those dumbbells ready. Start in a high plank position while keeping your hips as straight and steady as possible, straight across. You're going to row one arm up, bring the elbow past the back, and then slowly and controlled return back to the starting position and do the same thing on the other arm. If you look in the upper right hand corner at Minimi, she's on her knees, that's the modification. If you're doing it on your knees and you still want to make sure that your back is nice and flat, your abs are engaged, your belly is toward your spine, and those hips are straight across, nice and steady, so you're working that core. And we are resting in five, four, three, two, one. Next up, we have alternating narrow and wide bent over rows. Starting up in three, two, one. So you wanna start in a bent over position with your knees slightly bent and your back nice and long and flat. Hold your palms facing each other and then row those dumbbells all the way up so that your shoulder blades pinch together and elbows come past your back. And then you're going to just switch the grip a little bit, turning your palms down towards the ground and bringing the arms a little wider. So narrow with the palms together and then wide with the palms down towards the floor. Remember, you're pinching those shoulder blades together. Really trying to work those back muscles. 10 more seconds on the clock. Nice job resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, next up, triple threat abs. Get ready to work that core in three, two, one, here we go. So you're gonna start by lying down on the ground. Try to keep your legs as straight as possible and bring yourself up into a pike position. And then you're going to come all the way down again. Bring your legs apart a little bit and then crunch up, reaching towards the middle and then all the way back down again and knees to your chest. Modification is just regular crunches if you look in the upper right hand corner. Just do what you can. Suck in those abs, engage that core. Nice job, you got this, 15 more seconds on the clock. Resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we are doing round two of the circuit, back to plank to rows. So have those weights ready in three, two, one. Start it up, high plank position. Hips straight across, feet about hip width apart. Engage that core and row one arm up, elbow past the back, slowly return to the starting position and repeat on the other side. Again, mini me is on her knees, back is still flat. Still trying to keep that upper body steady and the hips straight across. 20 more seconds. Ten more. Pressing in five, four, three, two, one. Next up we have narrow, alternating narrow and wide bent over rows. Starting in three, two, one. Here we go. So knees slightly bent, back lengthened and flat. Narrow row with your palms facing each other and then palms down and wide row. Shoulder blades are pitching together. Twenty more seconds on the clock. Nice job. Try to keep your upper body as steady as possible. Ten more seconds. Resting in five, four, three, two, one. 
All right, let's end the circuit with triple threat abs. In three, two, one. Start it up. So pike position all the way back down the ground. Middle all the way back down and knees to your chest. Modification is just crunches. Just lifting those shoulder blades off the ground. You can do it with your knees bent and feet on the floor. Good work. Take your time with this. Really work on sucking in those abs. 20 more seconds. Ten more, hang in there. Resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, next circuit. Sit up to row is what we're starting with. So you need your lighter weights for this one. And it's go time right now. Here we go. So start with your arms extended, weights right above your chest with your back flat on the floor. Take a deep breath in. And then exhale, peel your back off the floor, keeping those arms straight in front of you. Then you're rotating, get the shoulder blades together, bring it back out, and slowly back down to the starting position. So this works a lot. Your core, you get a lot of shoulder works actually in this exercise, as well as back. Because you're trying to hold those weights up the entire time with your shoulders, and then you're pulling it in using your back. Good work, just take your time with this. 10 more seconds. Resting in five, four, three, two, one. All right, next we have the Superman to opposite arm and leg extension. This is a tough one, so take your time. Three, two, one, here we go. So you're gonna start in a high plank position, lower yourself to the ground with a nice flat back. You can do a Superman using your lower back and then opposite arm and leg extension, which is tough, it takes a few reps to get the hang of this. So just take your time. Again, in upper right hand corners, mini me, she's just on her knees doing that arm and leg extension. So Superman, use the lower back and shoulder blades together. Come up with a flat back into a high plank position. Extension, extension, and then right back down again. Good, 10 more seconds on the clock. Resting in three, two, and one. Next we have a lap over with a sit up and we're gonna start with our left leg extended. So you're gonna need your weight and let's start it up. So right knee is bent, left leg ex is extended. Try to keep those legs together as much as possible. As you reach the weight over your head, the arms extended, and then full sit up and reach towards your extended leg's ankle. So lat pullover, lower back stays on the ground. Full sit up, reach towards your ankle. The modification is just a crunch with a lat pullover. You can keep your knees bent for that one. And both feet on the ground. Pressing in five, four, three, two, and one. Nice job. Now we're just gonna switch legs. So same exercise, but the right leg is extended. So lots of lap pullovers and lots of sit-ups. Here we go, start it up. Right leg extended, left knee is bent, lap pullover. And all the way up into that sit-up, reach towards the right ankle. Any more seconds? Hang in there. Abs and back should definitely be feeling this by now. 10 more seconds. Resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, round two. Coming up next, sit up to row. So lighter weights. Start it up. Arms extended right above the chest. Full sit up. Pull the weights in. Get the shoulder blades together. Bring the arms back to extension and then slowly return back to the starting position. Take your time. 
Inhale, exhale and up. Twenty more seconds. Good, ten more. Resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, we are back to the Superma Superman and opposite arm and leg extension. Here we go, start it up. So high plank position with your back flat, go all the way down to the ground to your Superman using your lower back. And then come all the way back up again with a flat back, and opposite arm and leg extension. The Superman is gonna work your lower back, your glutes and your hamstrings. Come all the way up to that high plank. You're working your abs. Again, glutes and hamstrings with the leg raise. A little bit on the shoulders. And the upper back. Ten more seconds. Five, four, three, two, and one. All right, flat pull over with the sit up. The left leg is extended on the next exercise. Start up in three, two, one. So right knee is bent, left leg is extended. You're gonna do your lap pull over, bring the weight over your head, keep the lower back on the ground, and then reach up as you sit up towards your left ankle. Remember the modifications are there if you need them. Just do your best. You want to keep on moving through the 12 minutes. 20 more seconds on the clock. Good, 10 more. Resting in five, four, three, two, and one. All right, switch it up. Right leg, right leg is extended this time. Starting in three, two, one. Flat pull over, full sit up, you got this. Inhale as you bring the weight over your head, exhale as you crunch it up and reach towards that ankle. All right, guys, and we are done in four, three, two, one. Woo! Awesome job. Woo!